NTD has obtained photos from inside the Chinese regime's internal epidemic prevention meeting on January 16th. It's further evidence that the regime concealed the outbreak from the rest of the world. The January 16th meeting occurred in Shijiazhuang, the capital of Hebei province. This image shows the timestamp 1401-36, January 16th, 2020. It was taken at the city's health system safety and novel coronavirus prevention and control meeting. After the meeting, the city set up a municipal health committee and two expert groups for medical treatment and disease control. It also designated a hospital for treatment of an unknown disease. One day before the meeting on January 15th, China's National Health Commission issued a special notice to provinces and municipalities on the diagnosis, treatment and prevention of an unknown pneumonia caused by a novel coronavirus. The notice is labeled as special class, the highest classification, meaning it must be processed immediately. It outlines secret training on a novel coronavirus treatment program. It explains that some Wuhan hospitals had been finding cases of an unknown pneumonia since December 2019. The notice says the result of a scientific analysis showed it was a novel coronavirus. The notice goes on to outline detailed requirements for medical staff, including guidance on protective gear and how to reduce transmission risk inside hospitals. The Associated Press also reported that China's National Health Commission held a secret video conference on January 14th. Health officials stressed in the meeting the epidemic situation had become complex and severe and the virus could spread abroad. On January 16th, the Hebei Province Health Commission forwarded the special case memo to city-level health commissions. The next day, the Zhejiang City Health Commission issued an urgent notice on the prevention of infectious diseases. It told health bureaus to focus their work on the prevention of such infectious diseases as influenza and unknown pneumonia. But it wasn't until three days later, on January 20th, that the Chinese regime publicly gave instructions on prevention and control for the first time. That night, an expert admitted for the first time there was human-to-human -human transmission.